Hello there, beautiful people. Hope you're having a beautiful day. Let's have a look around here for a second. Yeah, what do you think? Oh yeah, nice one. Oh no, it's beautiful out here, loving it. Um, I just wanted to talk today just about an experience that I had, which is gonna lead to a uh, just a bit of awareness for yourself. So basically, breathing love into your body, breathing love into and healing into any part of your body that you require. Mm. I'll give you a small story behind this, yeah? So I encountered uh, food poisoning recently, and um, yeah, I won't spare you the details of that bad boy, but um, basically I uh, was in bed and not in the best state, but I was all right, I was calm. I was just like, I got this, I'll be right. So all I, in those moments, I was just breathing in love. I was like breathing in healing, just slowly and calmly. I did it for like a, a constant hour and it was just insane. And then I just kept doing it. I remember, I just remember after the hour, I kind of was fully aware of it. I didn't even, I didn't even realize I was doing it. I was just like, all right, do this, do this. And then I became conscious of it. And then I was like, just did it for the rest of the night until I slept. Um, it's just so powerful. It allows you to maintain a positive mindset because when you're in a positive mindset, you can do anything. You're, you're capable of anything. You know, so maintaining that positive mindset is, um, it's, it's key. So yeah, I was just sitting there, lying there, sorry, lying there, just breathing in love, breathing in healing, uh, you know, breathing in whatever I wanted to breathe into. And that's not just with bloody food poisoning. You could do this in any day life. Like you could be in the office at your work or you could be wherever you want with people and just breathe in positivity, breathe, breathe in um, strength, breathe in whatever you want to